Here we yeah, go. Guys. I've got my. Do you, want me to tell you? Do you want me to tell you? No, I've got Leonard now. Maybe it's buffering. <laughs> Josh Adams. Yes. Josh Adams, correct. Rightly so. Bundyaki. Oh, Bundyaki. Dan Bigger. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Elliot Daly. Surprised. Very surprised. Utility. Gareth Davis at nine. Gareth Davis. Wait for the next one. Owen Farrell. Owen Farrell, yeah. I mean the next one. Chris Harris! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> and sure. Chris, Chris, Hogg, Chris. Yeah. Oh, Chris Harris! Stuart Hogg, okay. Let's see what his picture looks like. Oh, oh, he's he's just, just slid in the game now. Jim, your mate Thomas on the comments is going to be happy. He's just Connor Murray, Murray, great picture of Hoggy. Great picture of Hoggy. Connor Murray. Ali Price. Ali Price, get in this, get in this one. Yeah, Lewis young Lewis Reece Summit. Yeah. Oh, Finn, in. come it's on, in. son. Come on, son. Go, whoa. S is next. Is it Sexton? No, Sexton's not made it. Who undone the murder? Come on, the Scotland lads. Come on. There's your, and Watson, there's your backs. Anthony Watson, yeah. I'm ahead of you, boys. Liam Williams. Don't, don't, ruin it. don't spoil it. Don't spoil it. Now the forwards. Here we go. He's a ghost. Oh. He sees dead people. Oh, burn, burn. Jack Conan, you had him before, Goody. Pulled it. Pulled him out last minute. Fair play. Fair play. Cowan Sicky. Yeah, Luke Cowan Dickey. Tom Curry. Oh. Nice. I like that selection. Xander Ferguson. Yes, yeah. sir. <laughs> Whoa. Gold it. Gold it. Talupe. Talupe Falatau. Boys, there's some left field decisions. Yeah, big time. Ty Furlong. Ty Furlong. Don't, don't spoil it, lads. Oh. Jamie George in the mix. Jamie George. All right. Ian Henderson called it. James Ryan, maybe not. Johnny Hill. Oh, oh wow. my God. Amazing for Johnny. Sort the lid out. Keep it. No, no, no. Oh, touch and go. Touch and go. Oh. Alan Wynn. Skips. Oh. Wynn Jones. Called it. I said he was starting. Lou said. Courtney's made it, not played without in Laws. Yeah. Oh my word. Versatility that James though. Ryan. That means James Ryan's not in. Ken, Ken Owens. Andrew Porter, good shout, Jim. Yeah, called it. Wow. Sam Simmons, there we go. Go on, Goody, son. Go on, Goody. Oh, oh, you've got him in. Rory Sutherland. Oh, yes. 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 <laughs> Tipperick, he's an absolute world of a player, isn't he, Tipperick? Yeah. Mako from the pole, I'm sorry, yeah. should have picked you. Lads, I'm buzzing. We just Billy need Hamish now. Sam Simmons, come on! Hamish, Hamish yes. Watson. Yeah, there we go. There we go, wow. Lads, this is unbelievable. <laughs> oh, my goodness me. I, I, wow. I told you... I told you Warren Gatlin hates the, hates, the, hates the Irish, doesn't he? Like, he hates us. Like, can someone mention oh, Tyke Furlong didn't wow. make it? Tyke Furlong did Furlong not make it. Yeah, it did. No, he did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, yeah no. Tyke Furlong did. James Ryan, James Ryan. Then I had a feeling James Ryan. I'm gutted for Johnny Gray. No, Billy. Um, my lads, where do we start? Um, Johnny God, Hill. let's go for the headlines. I mean, who's, who did he go for a scrum off? Ali Price, uh, Gareth Davis, and Conor Furlong. Murray. Yeah, and Conor Murray. Let's start. Should we start with the front row? Yeah, go front row, Jim. Right. Who have we got then? Uh, someone's going to say, I'm, I'm absolutely... R Rory Sutherland. Yeah, let's start off. Lucid props as Wynne Jones, Rory Sutherland and Mako Vanapola. Happy. So no, no Kean Healy. No. 
Uh, uh, Sutherland's big news, though, isn't it? That's a you know, fully deserved. Yeah, I, I, well, I didn't pick him because I heard he was injured. That was yeah. why. No Genge, no Genge, no, no Marla, no Kian Healy. Yeah, yeah. but well, all right, English like, prop. one English prop in Mako Vanapola. Um, I didn't know, did he? Joe Russell, eight Scots. How good does that sound? <laughs> <laughs> Lads, this is unbelievable. Right, I'll start mate, trying to stay calm. That's what happens when you finish fourth and have your best year ever. Mate, you mate, get alive. Alive. <laughs> You've been in the way. Well, yeah, yeah. Like, we'll come on to it. We'll come on to the um there's like lo obviously loads coming in, which is class. I'm absolutely buzzing. Yeah. So we've gone through the loose heads. Let's go through the hookers. Okay. Yeah. Jamie George. Luke Cowan Dickey. Yeah. And Ken Owens. I, I Ken think Ken a lot Owens. of us had them. I mean all, yeah, yeah, all, all pretty legit. All good. Yeah, yeah. Tight Ed. So we've got uh, Ty Furlong. We've got Xander yeah. Vegas. I called it, mate. He's quality. Yeah, I'm telling you. Yeah, yeah he is. Yeah, he, he is. is. And Andrew Porter as well. A lot of people were like, mm, "Come on, Andrew Porter." He's a big bloke, Andrew big. Porter. He's, He's huge, big. mate. He's exactly what you want. I had him in my squad. Oh, lads. Well, let's move on to the second rows. My goodness me. We we were chatting about this, for, uh, Stevie, about uh, Ian Henderson going and, and potentially, um, obviously, James Ryan, James Ryan not. I mean, I feel for yeah. James Ryan. I mean, picking Johnny Hill, for me, is a big call. I mean, Johnny Hill's a great player, quite inexperienced, but picking him ahead of James Ryan. Yeah, yeah no, it's, a, it's, a, it's a huge call. Like, it's huge. But do you know what? Like... I love the look of this team. I just think Courtney Laws. so many surprises in there. Courtney Laws, like he hasn't played in ages. He wasn't part of the well, he actually got injured in one of the games in Six Nations. Travis uh, Six so and, left, and second row though. Yeah, so left field, but like I'm absolutely made up. Delighted for Ian Henderson. I think he's uh, mm. he's had his critics over the last couple of weeks, but bloody hell, he was one of Ireland's best players in the Six Nations. Um, his work is a big game player, isn't it? He's a big game player, Jim. He's a big man. He's you know he's he's a tall, he's a big unit. He was there in 2017. He was one of the best players in the midweek side. He got man of the match against the Hurricanes when it was 33 all um, before the last test. He's been there. He's done it. He knows what it takes. So absolutely made up for him. Uh, but yeah, the second rows and back rows. The second rows in number six. I think wow, what what selections? Unbelievable. Yeah, it is. Yeah, and I just want to call out my just before Goody, I just want to call out um, Ruby Passio, Neil Martin, who told me that he thought Carl Sinclair was going to go, and I picked Andrew Porter. So the experts, lads, but I'm absolutely buzzing on it. Um, what else? Yeah, Carl Sinclair. We'll come on to the props after. Um, should we talk about a bit about the back row? Obviously, there's yeah. no, isn't there? no, Sam, Underhill. No, no Underhill. No Underhill. No. So, Sam Simmons, just leave it there. Absolute world class ball in hand player. Uh, Underhill, I, I just think his form since he's come back from injury hasn't been as electrifying as, as others. Uh, Navidi misses out as well, which is a shame. I thought he played Courtney well. Laws. Courtney Laws. It's, and Courtney Laws. It's, it's the versatility, though, with Courtney Laws. He can play six, he can play second row. And, you know, in a reduced squad, and we're still trying to work out, yeah, 21 forwards he went with and 16 backs. You need versatility. Uh, that's what Courtney Laws gives you. Yeah, and then the obvious ones like Tipperick and uh, and Hamish Watson. Um, anyone in there, Stevie, that you think uh, like, he would have got for yeah. you happy? No, like Jack Conan. Like, to, to yeah, me, that's a bit left field. Like, um, I didn't well, see Goody, him. Yeah. Goody, had him. Goody, had him. Goody had him in his squad and up until the Leinster game at the weekend. Yeah. Swapped him for yeah. Vander. Yeah. The, the only the only thing with him is like he's been so injury prone over the last couple of years. Like, it would not surprise me again in the World Cup. The, he had a broken foot. Jordy Murphy had to fly out and cover him in the Rugby World Cup in 2019. Um, there's loads of question marks around his durability. The, other, the only other, like Falatai and, and Simmons, like I think, are, are two guys that I would love to have played with um, and hated to play against. So, yeah, the back row for me is, is really exciting. I think uh, Shanks could be right. Courtney Laws could find himself in the sixth jersey very easily. Imagine, yeah. oh, See a Khaleesi, Courtney Laws, boom, it's going to be unbelievable. Lads, I tell you what, we were Jacob McDonald Jeez, said 7K mate. viewers, let's say it's 7 million. I'm absolutely buzzing. I've not, I don't even know where I've put the names and stuff like that. Shanks, happy with the scrum offs? Yeah, I think Thomas Williams might feel a little bit lucky. I think if he's fit, um, he probably offers a little bit more, but Gareth Davis is still good. So, yeah, no real. 
no massive, huge surprises there, I don't think. Um, I had Ali Price in. I had Colin Murray in. It was either toss-up between Thomas Williams and Garth Davis. So, they've gone there. But, guys, the back yeah. to the biggest talking point now. Well, well let's, wow. let's go there, Shanks. Shanks, let's go there. We Absolutely can bypass wild. the tent. Let's talk about, what, where do you want to start? Bundyaki? Yeah, did not see that coming at all. No Gary Ringrose. Am I right? Have I got that yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, it's not. Yeah. Um, how's, how's that happen then? Uh, well, no Henry been... Slade? No. Yeah. No. Harris. Harris, the most physically dominant tackler in this <laughs> nation. <laughs> Come on! I'm oh, buzzing. Hey, Scotland lads. Anyway, Bundyaki over, Ewan says, over to Alagi. Is Bundy, was Bundyaki I mean, injured? I'm sure he was playing for Connacht, weren't he, when the lads were playing? Well, he was in the squad, wasn't he, Stevie, in the Six Nations, but it was more Ringrose and Henshaw as the two centres. Yeah, well, well, didn't he, um, then he get sent off for the red card, didn't he? In the England game, yeah. Yeah, in the England game, so he's missed a few weeks. Um, he was out injured earlier in the season as well. Um, I want lads. I tell you now, Bundyaki has he has got something special. He does. He goes up. He bashes lads. He's got lovely ball skills as well. He can act as a second second receiver. Absolutely no questions about that. Um, he played against Ulster uh, just after the first lockdown, and I was just so impressed with him. Is vo how vocal he is on the pitch. Yeah. Like you know, he's such a good uh, communicator as well. I think he'll bring a bit of a bit of crack uh, and a bit of fun to the party. I think he's a really good lad off the pitch. So Bundyaki, I didn't see it coming. But I think it's only a good thing for the Lions. 